Hi, I'm Rachel, and today we're going to be going over how to teach elementary school students how to make change with money. So a great way is to give them examples. I like to show them a menu, like for a diner or some you know, place in the neighborhood that might be popular, and have them actually add up. Um, you know, if you have a $20 bill, and let's say you, you know, bought a milkshake and a burger or something like that, um, and say you spent $15.75, well, how do you make change for $20? There's two ways. One is counting up, adding, and the other is counting down, subtracting. Um, counting down from 20 or counting up from 1575. First, let's look at counting up. Well, you can start with 1575 and you can add 1 to make 16, then you can add 2 to make 17, then 3 to make 18, then 4 to make 19. So you have 1975, and then you're going to add 25 more cents to make $20. So that would be one, two, three, four, and then you added 25 cents. So that would be 425. The other way is counting down. You can start with 20, and you can count down. Okay, so 20, so 19, 18, 17, 16. So that's four. And then you have to go 25 cents more down to get to 15.75. So that way is through subtraction. I like to show both ways because people's brains work in different ways and sometimes addition is easier, sometimes subtraction is easier, but it's good for them to practice both so that they can become familiar with both ways and become better at both subtracting and addition. I'm Rachel and thank you for learning with me today.